It is the second day that the employees of the T.A. Marisha Community College have turned out to demonstrate their discontent with the offer brought forward to them by the time CC Management Board and Government. The offer, according to Public Workers Union President Rachel Roberts, is for increments or salary increases for only 2014. In 2013, increments were frozen under the Structural Adjustment Program, placing TAMCC workers in a bind as the tertiary institution is a statutory body. Roberts explains that the subvention from government to TAMCC cannot fully support workers' financial demands, and it is only government that can regulate the fees for TAMCC students. So TAMCC doesn't have the ability to charge the two costs of any program that a student may undertake at the institution. So therefore, TAMCC is trapped. Their hands are tied and they cannot do anything unless the government support them. The union leader adds that it is therefore up to government to expand more towards the tertiary institution. According to the PWU president, over $6 million is owed in increments, with the unions calling for at least two years of increments up front, rather than the proposed one year by time CC and government. They are owing them approximately 2.8 something million for 2014, another 1 point something million for 2016, and another 2 point something million for 2017, and approximately a few hundred thousand dollars for 18. Another similar industrial action is planned from Monday, with workers and unions committed to resolving the issue. And we are not going to give up on this matter until all, every black cent, every penny of our increment is paid. So we are going to start and firm with our membership as a public workers union and we are saying that the GOT will be joining us very soon on Monday so we know that we are strong and united we shall stand because we know in unity success is assured. Joseph McKeesmith, GBN News.